Hello, this is Nurida's Maths, and today I'm going to teach you how to solve first order differential equation, which are directly integrable. So, what does this mean? If we had a differential equation dy over dx, and that's equal to f of x, to solve this equation, all we do is integrate it to f of x. So this is just a general solution to this equation from here to here, but we'll do a question because it's more easy to explain. So here's a question. At time 0 seconds, there is 10 meters cubed of water in a box. When a small hole is made in the box, the rate of flow of water is minus 2 cos 3t. How much water is left after 2 seconds? So, first of all, we need to realize that we've got initial conditions. Think that, which is here. So before anything happens in this box, there's got to be 10 meters cubed of water. But then, a hole is made. I'll make that hole the bottom of the box there. And water starts to flow out. Should probably be blue actually. At minus 2 cos 3t. So if we were to write this as an equation, we'd say the rate of flow, and we'll use v for this, because it's volume, the rate of flow of water is equal to minus 2 cos. 3t. Yes. So from here we'd integrate it. And the integral of this, so v is going to equal to minus 2 over 3 sine 3t plus c. This is where the initial so where the initial conditions, this one comes in handy because it says at zero seconds there is 10 meters cubed. So let's substitute for v 10. It's going to equal to minus 2 over 3 sine of 3 times 0 plus c, which gives us 10 is equal to minus 2 gives us 10 is equal to c, because this bit here just becomes 0. So now that we've got a full equation, which would be v is equal to minus, we'll start with the 10 because it makes it look cleaner, 10 minus 2 over 3 sine 3t. Now it wants us to find it how much water there is in after 2 seconds. So all we do for that one is substitute 2 into t. So we can say 2 is equal to t. So we get v is equal to 10 minus 2 over 3 sine 3 times 2. And that gives us v is equal to 10 minus 0 0.188, which gives us the answer of v is equal to 9.812, if we round it. 